This will soon be a thing of the past in Skagit County and likely many more communities. Effective October 1st, people will no longer be able to take their glass bottles to the transfer station for recycling. So we just don't have any other options for recycling right now. It's fallout from the closure of the area's main recycler in Seattle due to a lack of demand for recycled glass. That means people who usually take their glass to Skagit County transfer stations will now just have to throw it away in the trash. There's been a decline in the demand for the glass in beer bottles. Um, I think maybe more people are drinking out of different containers. So, and that was the main product that our recycled glass was being made into. It's not what those in charge of recycling want to do, but they say they have no choice with the county's three transfer stations taking in just over 244 tons of glass in 2023. More material that needs to be thrown out, more material that we're trucking and then sending on train to the landfill. We would like to see, you know, for a, a greenhouse gas reduction, we would like to see less material going to the landfill and to be recycled. But the situation is not a total loss. Landfills have to cover the trash they take in every day. That's typically done with soil, but now some of the glass that isn't being recycled will be used for that. While this glass is, it is going to, when it's going to the landfill, it's often um, being put as a replacement for that. So they can put a layer of this crushed glass down over the open cell, so it's sort of replacing the use of the soil. Right now, the Skagit County restrictions only apply to people who bring their glass to transfer stations, but officials say that could expand to curbside as well if the market for recycled glass doesn't improve. The Department of Ecology says the restrictions will likely be in place at least through the first quarter of next year, if not longer. In Skagit County, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.